Hi, this is Scott Richardson, the bench doctor from the Liberal Gun Club, and this is just a continuation of my s sort of quasi-restoration of a um, Colt police positive from 1921. If you go back to the first uh, video in this series, you'll see how beat up it was. And um, I went through um, disassembling the gun and cleaning it and getting it prepped for rust blowing. And in the last series, I showed you how to degrease it and apply the rust blowing solution. And today, it's been uh, almost 24 hours of just sitting on this rack in my garage here in Oregon where it's plenty moist. Uh, and I thought I'd show you what the rusting looks like. Uh, it's not showing up on camera really clearly, but it's got a very fine um, orange rust on it. Um, very consistent uh, on all of the pieces. Um, you know, they're, they're consistently the same orange color. Uh, very fine coating of orange rust. So, let me get the frame undone. And here's the frame. Uh, it, it looks horrible, but that's what you want. You want that rust. So from here, what I'm going to do, and I'll, I'll do it off camera because we've all seen water boiling. It's not that exciting. Uh, I have an old pan dedicated just for this purpose. I don't, wouldn't do this with uh, one of my pans that I eat food out of. But you bring deionized water, uh, or distilled water. This is what I use, just straight up distilled water. It's about 89 cents a gallon at Walmart. Any distilled water will work. Um, you get it boiling and you drop these parts in for five or 10 minutes and you let them boil. And uh, when I come back, these this rust will turn black. Uh, once the rust has turned black, we can then cart it off with a carding wheel or a carding brush. Um, a carding brush or a carding wheel is, let me grab one here, this is a carding brush. And it looks like a wire, just a regular wire brush, but it's super soft. I mean, it is just very, very soft, really fine, like human hair, fine um, strands. You, you don't want it to be a super heavy um, wire. Or you can just use, this is triple lot steel wool. It's a very, very fine, extra fine steel wool. You soak this in acetone, and it will remove any oils and grease from the manufacturing process when they create this stuff. But this is the cheapest way to do it, is just get some really fine steel wool, degrease it, and then uh, you can card the rust off with this. So I'm going to now take these parts and uh, boil them like I said, for five or ten minutes. And when I come back, uh, they will be black. They'll be a black oxide, and then I'll show you how to card them off. And then once they're carded, um, we will then reapply the rust blowing solution, just like we did in the last video. Um, and we just repeat this process as many times as it takes to get the uh, color, the shade of, of blue black that we want. Uh, and then when that's completed, we'll just throw this all in a um, uh, cup or pan of uh, or plastic bucket of either kerosene or used motor oil with no detergent in it or mineral oil, just some sort of oil to get in there and displace and deactivate the rusting process and uh, to also, you know, um, saturate the surface. And uh, once that's done, we can then clean it off and reassemble the gun. And uh, so I'll show you those steps in the next video, but I'm going to go ahead and take these and boil them. And when I come back, uh, I'll show you how the carding process. So thank you. I'll be back in a minute.